August of 2023, everything hit the fan. A company called Billet Labs had sent LTT a prototype water block. It was a one of a kind piece of hardware meant to cool a specific GPU. LTT tested it on the wrong GPU, got some inaccurate results, and instead of retesting it, they decided to publish the video anyway. And if that wasn't bad enough, that same prototype got auctioned off later by LTT at a charity event without the owner's permission. On its own, it could have just been a mistake. Unfortunately, it wasn't the only one. Tech reviewer Steve Burke from Gamers Nexus released a video that pulled no punches, accusing Linus Tech Tips of rushing content, cutting corners, and letting accuracy take a back seat to output. And the truth be told, he wasn't even wrong. For years, Linus Tech Tips had been posting nearly every day across multiple channels. I don't think they meant to, but there was some carelessness. Gamers Nexus didn't just catch one mistake, they caught a pattern of mistakes. The reaction was immediate, Fans who trusted LTT for over a decade suddenly had doubts. Linus tried to defend the team in the forums, but the tone missed the mark. Then he had to walk it back and issue a public apology. The company released a video called What Do We Do Now? Admitting to the mistakes, apologizing to Bill at Labs, and announcing a temporary production pause to improve internal processes. It was a good move, the right thing to do, but the apology felt half-hearted because the video, they monetized it, and it had sponsors and even some jokes mixed into it. For a lot of viewers, it felt like they were treating the situation like more content instead of accountability. Ability. The damage was done. Linus Tech Tips wasn't as untouchable as they had hoped. Then, as if things couldn't get any worse, they did. 